We just can't quite seem to get enough of winter. It just keeps rearing our head. I'm ready for this one to be over. Good grief, it's April 5th and man did we get snow again. We're working in the shop for a little while. Let's go see what's going on in here. We got sprayer detailing cleaning going on. This sprayer has been getting serviced. We're getting that leaky hose fix that I was talking about. Zach over here is working on that for me. Yeah. He's homeless, so. <laughs> we got Brandon walking around with a wrench. Adjustable hammer. We got the John Deere sprayer here. We're getting serviced up. What you doing? Taking the oil filter off. That's a dirty filter. I always knew you were a gymnast. We got Jerombus up there just cleaning away. Doing my womanly duties. Detailing. Get this puppy's windows cleaned up. Make them shine for a little while for this spring. Doesn't last very long, but I gotta do something while I wait for this snow to melt. Preston's up there looking pretty cleaning windows. Ooh, look at that blazer. Oh man, that thing is clean. Whew. Get roasted. It's beautiful outside today. I could go for a nice winter walk. Oh. Me and Zach here come to work on the water trailer pump just to make sure she'd run for the year if the carb needed to be cleaned or whatever. We try pulling it over and it pulls over extremely hard. I remove the oil plug and we got gasoline coming out of it. I mean, it's way over full, not too sure how that happens. I don't think oil is supposed to be watery like that. Definitely gas. Jeep. Yeah. He ain't making it, no way. <laughs> yeah, I think he's stuck. Boys will be boys. Grab the shovel. We're coming, Brandon. And he's out. Couldn't have picked a nicer day. Oh, it's beautiful out here. This is a quarter mile from our farm. Either direction we try going, it's just plugged deeper than deep. This storm, it's an ugly one. Well, luckily it's gonna be uh, 58 degrees on Tuesday. Yeah. Every road around us, every highway is closed, blocked solid. There's a lot of snow. Round two? No. I think this one might be deeper than the other one. What are you two losers doing? Clean Fixing out. your ice bath. Yeah, clean out your ice bath. Oh, give me a blazer wash. That's so cold. Big boy and the little guy. Bucket. Oh yeah, they got a couple open. They just refreshed it. Let's go see if we can open some roads and get stuck. Deep stuff and hard. Tell me how you really feel. I'm ready for spring. Well, Tuesday's gonna be spring. Oh, I'm glad for the moisture, but good grief. Look at this. It's taller than the front tire currently. It's as tall as the back tire. I'm eye level with Brandon. Oh. Oh. Made it.
I'm 6'2". Standing on snow. sun visor up. Rolling the dough. Except for it's snow. <laughs> I can video us peeing. Helps on the way. Cameron! Yeah. Guess what? What? Yup. Correct. You leave the yard, leave the yard and go east and you'll see us. Yeah, you'll see us. We didn't make it very far. He's a little stuck. Help has arrived. We made it. Finally. Oh. Well, that's not ideal. Yeah. Well, we got through this one, but man, that is deep stuff there. It's up there. Camera probably don't do it justice. There's a lot of snow out here. We're off on another rescue mission. Got my buddy following me in my pickup. He's bringing the Yankum and some clevises, and I'm in the RX, and we're gonna go pull the neighbor out. He slid into the ditch, evidently, so let's see when we get there. Well, found him. Shouldn't be too hard, as long as he doesn't keep going down in the ditch where it's steep there. There we go. Oh yeah, just walks it right out. Well, here's mine and dad's first drift. This is where we were playing with the Jeep last night and getting stuck. We just got punched through this one. I mean, that's freaking deep. This is pretty bad. We have not made it very far. We made it about a mile from the farm. An hour later, this is where we're at. See, it's not so bad to have a big payloader. Even though it's overkill, it ain't overkill today. Finally punched through that one. He's sending it on the next. Yeah, he didn't make it very far. I mean, this is a small one. This one isn't even bad. Oh, you know, just, I'm six foot. It's as tall as me. This storm's gonna take North Dakota a while to dig out of. Well, almost three hours later, we made it to the highway up there. It took us three hours to make it five miles. Now this one here is the bad one. I mean, we're as deep as the payloader here. This is ridiculous. It's like driving through a tunnel. I mean, just to get a trail through took probably an hour to get through this one. I mean, like I said earlier, I'm six foot and that's a long ways past me. Oh boy. That's gonna take him a while to get through that tunnel. Dad just got done pushing this one back. It looks pretty nice. Just so we don't get more snow and it blows in even this deep now. My oh my, would that be bad? But the forecast is looking good for a few days. We're supposed to get up to 65, 70. So next comes flooding instead of 
too much snow. So that should melt a lot of it down. Uh, but we gotta get, try to get as much of it off the road as we can. It doesn't just melt on the road forever and just make a sloppy mess. So here's what our tunnel looks like on our road going to our highway. I've never seen this much snow before. Like, this hard to get out our road. This is absolutely unreal.